for the law of the spirit of life has set you free in Christ Jesus from the law of sin and death. So what is the law of sin and death? That is the position that we were held in while we were in Adam. All of mankind is born into Adam, the sin of Adam, the death of Adam. And so all of mankind is held in the law of sin and death. That is the power of sin and death. That is the position of sin and death because all mankind is in Adam. It's only when we are born again and come into Christ that we get set free from the law of sin and death. And so that's what it says here. For the law of the spirit of life has set you free in Christ Jesus. So anyone who comes into Christ Jesus is set free from the law of sin and death. How? By the law of the spirit of life. And so what is the law of the spirit of life? That is being born again. That is being born of the spirit. It's talking about regeneration. It's talking about coming into a new position in Christ. Before we were held in the law and the power of sin and death in Adam. And so now, because we've been born again, we've come into a new position. We are no longer in Adam. We are now in Christ. We are no longer in the flesh. We are now in the spirit. We're no longer under the law. We are now in grace. We are no longer dead in Adam. Now we are alive in Christ. We are no longer under the power and control of sin. Now we are under the power and the control of the spirit. We are no longer slaves to sin. We are now slaves to righteousness. We are no longer under condemnation. Now there is no condemnation for those who are in Christ Jesus. And so it's actually very important as we go on to see that these verses are speaking about a position. It's speaking about a position change. We've changed from Adam. We've come into Christ. We've been set free from the position, the law of sin and death. We've come into the new position of the spirit of life. And that is because we died with Christ and rose again with Christ. And all of this has been a work of the spirit and a work of grace and a work of God 